since Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. So for a full week we have been at this. Alright? And through those four weeks, we have had police brutally handle us. We have had our sisters and brothers in Cape Town being shot at. We have had our sisters and brothers in NMU being shot at. We have been tear gassed. We have been pepper sprayed by private security entering our campuses. We have had white men point knives and guns at us in our institutions. Who see that now we have shut their institutions down? They want to bar us from buses so that we constantly have to walk from Park Town to Brom, mm. thinking we will be demoralized. We have had to clean our own toilets on campus. We have had to mop our own floors on campus. Nothing wrong. Our network is down. UP's network is down. The internet is down. So that we don't narrate the story. We don't narrate the true story of what is happening in our institutions of higher learning. They have seen the power of social media and revolutions that can run on social media and they want to stop that from happening. But we are saying as the generation that is supposedly lost and born free that we are alive and we are radical and we are ready to take it to the streets. A revolution has been coming the whole year from roads must fall to open sterile bush to decolonize bits and now we are saying these must fall. It's only the beginning. In 1976, we fought against education not being equal for all. In 2016, we're fighting for fees. The fight does not come to an end, and we are saying today that it must come to an end. We are saying we are here, we're young and alive, we're ready to sleep on, on cold floors. We are ready to study together at Solomon House, now at Mount University. We are ready to teach ourselves and work with progressive lecturers. We are ready to take, take control of what belongs to us. No longer will we be dictated by lily white councils that know nothing about the black child they are meant to represent. We think we are tired of that. Listen to us. Your children have come and sat down on the floor of their home. Listen to us. Amanda! What we're going to, what I'm going to do now is hand over to the outgoing president of the Vet SRC. Comment Shara Kala. There's a bit of a noise happening there. Can we please subside it? Comment Shara Kala, the outgoing president of the SRC, is going to read the memorandum that we are presenting.